We've got some new information coming from WCCF Tech surrounding NVIDIA's RTX 5060 and 5060 Ti, and half of it sounds like great news, while the other half is just dreadful. We'll get the bad news out of the way first. WCCF Tech, according to their own sources, state that both the 5060 Ti and 5060 will utilize a PG152 board SKU, and the graphics card will be based on the GB206 GPU chip. Both cards will still utilize a 128-bit bus, which for a 2025 release is honestly quite pathetic, but thankfully since the 50 series is going to be utilizing GDDR7 memory, most likely from Samsung, and that's going to be running at 28 gigabits per second, which is considerably faster than GDDR6, that should help alleviate the shortcomings for such a slim memory interface. The reporting the interface would grant the cards a total of 448 gigabytes per second of bandwidth, so comparing that against the 4060 which has a memory bandwidth of 272 gigabytes per second, that's a 65% increase, and compared to the RTX 